CES, or Consumer Electronics Show, is the world's largest consumer electronics and IT exhibition that is held every year in the US. Due to the COVID-19 crisis, this year's event is being held as an all-digital platform for the first time. It's our first ever all-digital event. And what it does is it's providing a safe an efficient way to convene the industry and actually even to broaden the industry and to bring more of the world to CES. We really wanted CES to be a collaborative experience it's where every, all of our audiences can engage and communicate and work with each other, just like they do in real life CES in Las Vegas. The fair used to take place in Las Vegas, the US, every year. However, as the event has become an all digital experience, there's been a keen interest on how Korean companies and local governments will prepare for the event. Despite the poor conditions, about 300 participants, including domestic major companies like Samsung Electronics and LG Electronics, as well as different businesses, institutions, local governments and universities, joined the show. Korea had the second largest number of participants following the US. Welcome to CES 2021. Lots has changed since CES 2020. Our world looks different. And many of you have been faced with a new reality. One where, among other things, your home has taken on a greater significance. Samsung and LG Electronics, which are leading major businesses in the domestic market, have made a grand slam of various awards. And it has shown limitless growth potential of the companies in the global field. Well, I'm so glad the wait is over that I can finally share this next level viewing experience with you. Let me introduce the Neo QLED. During its virtual first look event last week, Samsung Electronics unveiled its new premium TV, the Neo QLED. Hello, and welcome to LG Press Conference at CES 2021. LG Electronics also introduced its first ever QLED mini LED TVs at CES 2021 as it's top of the line, offering among LG's 2021 premium LCD TV lineup. Samsung Electronics has grabbed the greatest number of Innovation Awards honours in Korea, including the one from the category of smartphone. Introducing the next generation of LG Pure Care line, designed to deliver high quality air management solutions and peace of mind for every space. Also, LG Electronics received its largest ever honours at the event. They have developed and released advanced skills for the core technologies of CES, which include AI, IoT and 5G network. From TVs, refrigerators, stylers, video displays to smartphones, the highest number of visitors experience the products of the two companies every year. And the two enterprises have also grabbed the most attention during this year's all-digital event. What is more, improved technical capabilities of the domestic companies and institutions have also been in the spotlight. A lot of different technologies for AI, which is the main theme of this year's event, have been introduced during the fair. Also, AI-based semiconductor technologies, as well as intelligent security sensors, have been released. In the case of overseas businesses, developers of computer technologies have participated in the event. You know, despite the challenges of 2020, technology continues to step into the forefront to be able to deliver a sense of connectivity and community uh, and real experiences in a new kind of medium. And we're incredibly proud to be CPA's uh, technology partner in the delivery of this first all digital CES experience. Please keep an eye on CES 2021, which is successfully taking place online.
And please send an email to BizTechKorea if you have any questions on CES or the technologies and products of the participating businesses. We'll give you the answers next week at BizTech Korea's CES 2021 Special Edition. Don't forget to tune in.